Oh. Yow, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? x here with another Yow vlog. Wanted to give you guys an update about the Portland Burnsiders. Mm, we've been a little bit low key since the Rewind Land, but we are still growing and striving forward. The um, our Sixes team did compete in a scrim tournament a couple weeks ago. Came in third place. We were quite pleased with that, and uh, we're excited about the upcoming ESEA season. Previous vlog I posted was about the RGL.GG League. I'm sure we will be interested in fielding a team in that as well. Uh, TF2-wise, you know, we've talked about um, organizing some weekly events. We are still working on organizing a special charity event, um, which um, I feel really guilty about not putting enough time into. Um, but, you know, we're still trying to push forward with it, and it, it, will, it will happen at, at some point. It just unfortunately might might take us a bit of time. Um, other stuff going on with the Burnsiders is we're continuing to play with our Dota 2 team, our community members in Dota 2. We would love to field a team in the Battle Cups um, for the TI buildup just every weekend, but we will have to see how that happens. Um, and, you know, I mean, the goal for the Burnsiders is to, you know, compete in the TI qualifiers for Dota, I mean, in the major qualifiers, you know, coming up in these next couple years, you know, just um, maybe we get knocked out in the first round, maybe we get knocked out in the second round, but, you know, at least just to have a, a group of players that, that can compete in that. Um, we're also, you know, always um, looking for players interested in other games like uh, Overwatch, Rocket League, you know, whatever. Uh, we're also definitely going to be supporting people in the local fighting game community more and more. Um, we have built a few connections with some people um, in, in Portland, as well as uh, sponsoring myself. I entered um, the last three tournaments in Portland for uh, Street Fighter, the monthly, big monthly tournaments. And um, this last one, I tied for 16th place out of 26. But I'm, I'm pretty pleased with that, so I'm making progress. That's cool. There's also definitely some other people in the community that are awesome people that we would love to sponsor to help them travel to other events around the country. Now, um, finally, I am working on a new Burnsiders logo. It is uh, pretty close to completion. Um, you know, to talk a little bit about it, um, the the bridge motif is, is really important to us. Um, Burnside is a street in Portland, and there is the Burnside Bridge. It kind of has these parapet things um, on it as, um, as well as very famous for having the Burnside Skate Park underneath the east side of the bridge. Um, and then, you know, not necessarily that these things get completely integrated into logos, but just the Burnsiders were about uh, friendly competition, good sportsmanship, inclusivity, training people up, you know, and just being a, a positive community space. Um, and uh, very, very excited about the way that that logo is coming together. I will be sharing it and unveiling it in the midst of a video regarding my super secret project. So, um, now you guys know when the new logo is going to be unveiled, um, at least conceptually, uh, but the video I'm alluding to um, is still definitely a bit out. Um, I'm hoping within a month we can maybe uh, release that, but we will have to see how that goes. Um, so stay tuned for news on that, ladies and gentlemen. That's all I am going to say about that. You can theorize and do whatever you want in the comments because, you know, freedom of speech. And, uh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for tuning in. Um, if you've got any questions about the Burnsiders, check out our subreddit. Head on over to our Discord and hit us up there. Thanks so much for tuning in. I am Eckstein. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out!